Hi guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Jesse, and normally I make YouTube videos about plants, house plants and house plant related things, but today's video is a little bit different and I'm very excited. This is like what the most excited I think I've ever been to film a video. Um, but today we are going to Forks, Washington and the little twy heart in me from sixth grade is screaming. If you don't know, this past week was my birthday and this is like my little birthday trip. So we're gonna be just driving out there and I don't know exactly what we're gonna be doing, but we're gonna take you along as we go. It's a very bumpy ride, sorry. Show them the fog. Oh, it's very foggy as well. Show them the fog. I will show the fog. This is Christopher. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be going out to Forks. We're probably gonna go to the beach if we can get out there. Apparently there's like a tsunami warning, so I don't know, we're gonna see. But I'm gonna take you along today and let's go. I'm so excited. Had to get a mandatory Starbucks. Starbucks is mandatory. Starbucks is mandatory, especially if you're on a road trip. And now we are on the way. I don't even know how to tell you how excited I am, which is very lame, but when I was in middle school, Twilight was my life. Like, truly my life. She was Team Jacob, roaster. No, I wasn't Team Jacob. I was I was <laughs> Team Edward for Bella because Jacob's for me. Right. And I, yes, I used to say that to people, so. Anyway, <laughs> we're on the way now and I'm very excited. We got our Starbucks locked and loaded and we are on the way. Your story. My, it's not my story. Okay, tell me the story. The story is that there was like a bakery next to the Starbucks that made cinnamon rolls. And then that's where they got the original inspiration for their cinnamon dolce latte syrup. And you love cinnamon dolce latte. I love cinnamon. Yeah, it's the best. They just got it back after like seven months. People who know, they know what the struggle has been. The brown you sugar know, you syrup. Know. Brown sugar syrup is not as good. It's not as good. Not as good. The place right by our house. The, <laughs> the Niagara Falls. Yeah, uh, it does. Boulevard Plaza. We're like two hours into our drive and it's about a four hour drive. I don't know if I mentioned that, but we took like a, I don't know, the highway that we were in took us through like this town and we saw Goodwill. So we're going to stop at the Goodwill really quick. And if I buy anything, I'll do a haul. I don't know what we're going to end up with, but we're going to the Goodwill real quick. It was not a nice Goodwill. There was nothing there. It was very small. We just made a quick stop. Honestly, I don't even really know where we are, but there's like a lodge here. So we grabbed some like snacks that are like vegan. They had like almost nothing, but we are just gonna go take some pictures down by this beautiful lake. And then we're gonna hop back in the car. We are about an hour away. Up the beach we can check into our airbnb in like a half an hour but we're starving so i think we're going to go into this thriftway over here and just get like some groceries to eat because there's literally nothing around here like this town is like 
It's bare bones, if you know what I mean. But we did pass a Chinese food restaurant, but we're vegan, so like we don't really know if we can eat there, so we're gonna look it up and see what we can do for dinner because we're literally starving. We are starving, but I wanna show you guys our little Airbnb. It's very small, but it's pretty cute. We have like a little kitchen area over there. Look, Forks Outfitters. We went to Thriftway and we got a bunch of like freezer food and snacks that we're gonna eat. And I'm heating up the oven right now so that I can make my vegan nuggets. And of course, of course, I'm gonna take you into the living room. We got all the Twilight books and the five movie collection. Hi, I'm cooking dinner. Um, I just made nuggets and hash browns, tater tots. I'm starving. Um, and we're just gonna relax for the rest of the night and hang out. I was telling Chris we should um, just read Twilight together. You wanna read the sex scene? I wanna watch the game. We need to play this parenting game. I am my kid's mom. No excuses, just solutions. Morality, it matters. Character, courage, confidence. Who is she? Did you look her up? For parenting? Yeah, everything. Mm -hmm. Social and political. Um, good morning, everyone. It is 7.45 in the morning. We're gonna be leaving in like 15 minutes. We're about to hit the road. Um, and I think, well, we had to get home like in time to feed the cats, cause they're probably pissed. We had someone feed them last night, but not this morning. So we have to get home to feed them. But I think we're gonna make a stop to get um, Starbucks, right? Okay, and then we're gonna go to like this rainforest that's closer back like in the direction of our house And we're also going to probably get food on the way as well, but what are we doing before that? Are we gonna go to the Truck the truck is on the way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go and see Bella Swan's truck at the Chamber of Commerce and then um, There's like a full Twilight store in this town like it's called native to Twilight and it's like a store of all Twilight things but that doesn't even open until 11, so I think we're probably gonna skip that. That's where we just stayed. It was in this building, which seems actually really... Damn, that building looks rough now that I'm seeing it from the outside. That's why I saw I was like, when I pull up, I was like... Oh, <laughs> but it was it, nice. It was, it was nice, fun. it was very cozy. It was very cozy. This town is like, truly, truly a small town. Look at my new camera. Oh, it's so pretty. 3,500 people in this town. So we just made a little quick pit stop at the like Timber Museum, which is right here, the Forks Timber Museum. And it's also right next to the Chamber of Commerce. <laughs> and outside here are like Bella's trucks, like two different trucks that, like two different variations of the truck that they had in the movie. So we're just gonna take a cute couple of pictures. <laughs> are we in Olympic National Forest? Yeah. HOH Rainforest. Okay, so, but Olympic National Forest, Okay, so we're in Olympic National Forest right now. We're driving to the huh, rainforest, or it's HOH, we're not really sure. I think it may be a Native American word, but we're not really sure. Okay, so, you know. Um, but yeah, we took a, a quick stop because there's some beautiful running water as we're like driving through here and Christopher's taking some pictures. I'm gonna go check out that waterfall.
okay, we've seen so many like livestock signs, like keep watch for livestock. And I'm like, I've been keeping watch. Haven't seen any livestock. Where are the animals? But I just see some cows now. There's cows. I'm going to show you. Hi! I love you! I love you! What a view. All right, well, we left Olympic National Forest and we just took like a bunch of pictures and drove through the forest to see what we could see and it was really pretty. We stopped a couple of times, did some filming, did some shots. Now we're on our way back home to our kitties. Uh, I think I said this earlier on in the video, but I feel really bad. We had someone feed them last night. We had Christopher's friend come and feed them last night. But I, I mean, we felt kind of bad asking them to feed them again in the morning when like we're already coming home. So they're just gonna eat late in the day today and I feel so sad. I feel so sad thinking about them wondering like, what are we gonna eat? So we're on our way home now. We have about a two hour, two hours and 13 minutes left. We're gonna stop and get Burger King because, Starbucks. and Starbucks. We need coffee and food ASAP because we really didn't eat anything. I've eaten an entire bag of kettle, kettle popcorn because I'm just like starving. That's the only food we have. So we're on our way back. Hopefully we'll be there soon. We got Burger King and they gave us extra fries. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. We're watching Hassan's stream right now. Hassan Abi. Um, we watch him all the time. Hassan, we love you. Um, please feed me. I am starving. I don't know why they gave us three separate bags. <laughs> uh, Thank you. And here are my two fries. Did you say 1986? Two fries? No, give me. All right, we got, we got Burger King. We got Starbucks. I'm so full and feel disgusting now. We're on the way home. I'm so tired, I wanna sleep. We're gonna go home, feed the kitties, take a nap, and relax. It's been a really nice weekend, though. It's been nice, right? It's been great. We're gonna go feed those kitties. Mom is home! Did you miss us? Hi! Hello! Hi, buddy! Are you hungry? Are you starving? Do you think Mom and Dad abandoned you? See yo. Oh, goodbye. Okay, let's eat. Who wants to eat? You wanna eat? Okay, let's eat. Well guys, we are home. I am tired. Well, Christopher had to run out to the bank. I'm home, I'm tired, and it is time for a nice long nap. So thank you so much for watching our cute little trip to Forks. I had a really good time. It was such a nice opportunity to get out of, you know, our routine. I'm a teacher and sometimes it can get exhausting. So it was really nice to get out of the area and take some really beautiful pictures and see some really beautiful sights. I will be back posting my regular content this week in my next video this week, which is, you know, houseplants and houseplant related things. But I wanted to take you along and I hope you guys had fun watching this video. I know I had a lot of fun this weekend. Thank you so much. I love you all. Leave me a comment down below if you'd like. I respond to all comments and I will see you in my next video. Bye.